Florida officer in Obama motorcade struck and killed by Matt Sedensky of the Associated Press. And I'm not entirely sure this isn't a copyright violation simply by reading this. Story coming from West Palm Beach, Florida. A motorcycle police officer who was part of President Barack Obama's motorcade to a campaign event in Florida died Sunday after being struck by a pickup truck. Officer Bruce St. Laurent, 55, was a 20-year veteran of the Jupiter Police Department and one of several officers from agencies across Palm Beach County helping with security for the President's visit. He was ahead of the motorcade on Interstate 95. Well, there, there's part of the problem. They were on 95. Preparing to shut down the highway when he was hit by a Ford F-150, Palm Beach County Sheriff Spokeswoman Terry Barbera said. He was taken to nearby St. Mary's Medical Center and pronounced dead. Jupiter Police Spokesman Sergeant Scott Pascarella told the Palm Beach Post he trained St. Laurent when he was a new officer. And I guess we are supposed to blame him? We didn't lose a co-worker, we lost a friend, Pascarella told the newspaper. He would do anything for anyone. I guess that includes taking a Ford. Barbara said an investigation was ongoing and no charges had yet been filed against the driver. Obama was on the second day of a bus tour through the key swing state and made a campaign appearance Sunday at the Palm Beach County Convention Center. White House Press Secretary Jay Carney said the president didn't see the accident, but he was notified of the officer's death and said, our thoughts and prayers are with the officer's family. The Post also reported that St. Laurent had been a motorcycle officer for 18 years and in 2005 earned a Distinguished Service Award by the Traffic Safety Committee of the Palm Beaches. The newspaper reported that in 2001 he was injured when a vehicle he was chasing suddenly stopped and he rammed into it. The two occupants were later arrested, one on a charge of driving with a revoked license and the other for having an outstanding warrant for reckless driving. Not that this little tidbit at the end has anything to do with the story. I don't even know why it's in there. Hey, it's a copyright of the Associated Press, all rights reserved. Don't even try and print this out. <laughs>